for GRIR clearing account means it is an intermediary clearing account for goods receipt, goods and invoice in transition. GRIR means G goods receipt and invoice receipt account. It is a balance sheet account for which balance is not zero at the time at the end of the period. And in some cases, GRIR account is uh, not zero. Uh, that is a uh, number one is goods received but not it invoiced. Means sometimes uh, um, some goods are received in the plant but invoice is not it received. And some cases invoice of goods which have not yet been received. Sometimes invoice is early, but goods uh, not in the receiving set. Goods means uh, uh, received not received in the plant. GRIR clearing account balance is not zero in SAP. Then the balance need to be either shown as an asset or liability in balance sheet for the period and closing. We can do some customization and OBYC. For GRIR clearing account purpose, we can do some customization OBYP. Mm, let us show some example. Uh, quickly, I raised two POs in ME21N. <clears throat> I taken supplier. Purchase organization is double six H five purchase group company code and material quantity hundred kgs net price is hundred plant is double six H five H five DR storage location. Check the document whether is it is okay or not. Okay, no issue. I can post. And same, I raise one more PO. And same supplier. Taking material. A material which is for 50 kgs net price is 100 currency agenda plant is double six hp storage location is hp here for this one po is for one PO, I, I was receiving the material in plant. For that, I was posting a MIGO entry. Checking the document. Whether is it is it okay? Okay. I was posting. And for another we another PO, I was receiving the invoice. For that, I was going to Myro transaction. Company go double six zero one. Invoice date references. Only invoice. This is second PO. <coughs> Here quantity is zero means I, I didn't receive any material. So I manually enter here. Baseline is.
and amount is pi to pi zero. If I check it in a message, quantity delivered is zero means we didn't receive any material for this PO. <coughs> I can simulate it and post it. If we observe this in MR11 T code, we can maintain Actually, this is a MM T code, MM module T code. Taking today's date. Here we see the both POs, GRR clearing accounts, and quantity received in 158 is 100. But invoice quantity is nil. Difference quantity here we will observe 100 kgs. And second PO, we didn't receive the quantity, but invoice quantity is showing. Difference is 150. This is a reflecting GRIR balance sheet. And one more T code is there for analysis purpose. F test F.19. We can take in the GRIR GL account. Company code is double six zero one. It is my period and closings means we can take as January as a closing. If you execute it, we can observe here BNG and GNB means BNG defense for invoice but not it delivered. GNB for delivered material but not invoiced. Okay, and for GRIR clearing purpose, we can do automatic clearing T code F, uh, F.13. Company code is 6601, fiscal year is 2022. I'm selecting the GRIR GL. Only I can do Posting date five one two zero two three. Here balance is showing in GRIR clearing account. Okay, for this first PO, I receiving the invoice one forty eight. Okay, one fifty eight. Sorry. 58 after posting we will observe on mr11 here balance invest quantity and um, quantity received both are same that's why 158 is automatically cleared in an uh, analyze grir clearing account here also we can check see gnb for 158 here also cleared you can check here automatic clearing here showing 158 both are green means we can clear it it is in test mode here i was posting goods receipt and receipt for 159 your second po which is invoice received it 
if we check in MR11, it will be all, it will be cleared. Okay, no data selected for check selection parameters means it is cleared. For F dot F dot 19, it will I hope it will be cleared. Okay, and there is no data. If we check in F dot 13, automatic clearing. F dot 13. Actually, it is a month end activity. That's why it's showing the error. Clearing date is not right. Okay, we see both 158 and 159 will be cleared. Balance is 0, 0. For this, we can check open line items FBL3N. Here I take GRIR account open items. Here we see both here red means open items. We can clear it from it. Remove the test run and execute it. Program run and production run. And clearing document is generated. Amount will be cleared. We can check it in. Open items. It will be cleared. We can see OBYP configuration in slash and OBYP. Here we can assign the GL accounts. It means uh, 100507 is GRIR clearing account. It is an adjustment account and target account is here. I can show in FS00 which GL it is. Here I put reconciliation account is 100507 which is GRIR account, GRIR clearing account. One one double zero five one zero means invoice received but not yet delivered. Here I had taken GRIR adjustment account. It is uh, for only for adjustment. Target account is two hundred double one three. Invoice received but goods not yet received. In this way, we can configure BNG also. Invoice received but uh, GNB also. That's it. We can do some activities on these different different scenarios. We will get some clarity. Thank you. This is it. Yeah, very nice.